Hello and welcome to SlimWalletJunkie.com's unboxing and video review of the wallet sleeve by Loft of Canby. Um, now I'd just like to first off give a, a little bit of a shout out to Justin Yap who was the one that pointed this out to us. He suggested on a previous YouTube video that we should check out this wallet. I'd not heard of it until he did that so just like to thank him for doing that and uh, remind you that you too can suggest wallets you think we should take a look at and we'll do our best to get around to them. So as you can see we've got two wallets today. We've got um, an original um, sleeve wallet and that's the black and brown version, the classic. Um, and then we've also got the sports in red and navy. We'll take a look at both of them um, on their own individually. So I'll just leave that up there for just a second so you can see. Obviously you can pause it if you want a little more time to read that. So as you can see the wallet comes in a really nice display box. Um, I was impressed with this because it's not an overly expensive wallet and this is the type of display you'd probably expect from a, um, a pricier brand. So this is nice and then you open the, the, the nice display box up and it's wrapped in um, in this black um, wrapping paper um, with a nice sticker on there. Um, I do think it's a nice logo as well, the Loft of Canby one. So um, all well presented so far. So we get the wallet um, itself and then we see it's got another little piece of, um, uh, I guess, marketing materials just saying thank you for buying, where you can follow them, uh, the web address, things like that. So it's nice, it's, it's quite a good quality one as well, not a flimsy little one that you sometimes get. Um, so we'll get that out of the way and we'll take a proper look at the wallet itself. So if I'm totally honest, I wasn't expecting um, that much from the wallets because I think the um, the pictures on their website probably don't do them justice. But um, I'm actually very impressed. I'll show you why. So first off, let's just look at um, what we've got. So we've got um, a, a pocket in the front there for cash, a card pocket in behind that, a main um, card pocket with a sort of sliding um, pull out tab that, that brings them out and another pocket in the back there. As you can see here the bottom part is well stitched leather and the top is a fabric material. So you load your cards in and you can fit, I've put in four cards here, you can probably fit a couple more and it's really nice this tab's really smooth motion and just pulls them out really simply so you can access them from that main pocket um, I think that's a really nice system, I'll show you from the other side, uh, really smooth, really easy you pull out the card you need and then you push them back in and automatically reload so as i said i've got four in there i'll put another couple in so six cards in here i think six is probably the maximum you're going to want because at six it became a little bit tougher to pull out certainly not not difficult but i think six is probably the maximum in this pocket which is quite a lot for a pocket of this sort i think it works really nicely with five and um, which is why i got rid of that that one so we can get another card obviously in this pocket which is your easy access pocket um, you're just going to be able to, to get to that just with um, one hand with your thumb and another one of those in the back. So you've got a couple of easy access pockets and a really nice slide mechanism. So I've got four in the middle, uh, five in the middle and one on each side. Um, so already quite a few cards in there, all really easy to get to um, and not bulking out at all. So then we've got this little cash slot in the front for notes um, and that fits really nicely. So I've got a few in there. So I've got three um, three notes in the front and um, as I said I've got uh, seven cards in there and you can see that's not really bulky at all and um, pretty slim uh, quite impressed with that and I think it looks really nice as well it's a, a good looking wallet um, so um, and I didn't point out earlier it's got the Loft of Canby logo down in the bottom right corner which I should have pointed out before um, but really easy really nice motion to to get those cards out and I'm as I say pleasantly uh, surprised and impressed with with how nice this wallet really is. So let's um, also take a look at the um, sports version. Uh, it's very similar, uh, again comes in a really nice packaging, just exactly the same as the classic version did. But instead of um, leather on the bottom, it's mainly uh, fabric. Now the fabric, I should mention this material uh, is ballistic nylon, so high quality nylon um, and the lining is cotton. Um, so it's got a few little bits of leather on the kind of touches the finishes so we had the logo down there a little bit on the cash pocket um, the key the key loop just like um, on the classic and the top of the uh, pull, pull tab uh, but other than that it's mainly the fabric the, um, the nylon um, which feels really nice actually it's really nice texture to it and it feels soft but a uh, good quality and um, so again it's exactly the same system works exactly the same way with loading the cards the, the pocket and um, I found that it took the cards just the same a little bit looser a little bit easier to get into them because obviously the genuine leather is a little bit stickier than a, 
a nylon fabric would be. Um, but other than that, pretty much identical. Just a case of, um, of differing um, taste, really, um, and what, what you prefer. This one, probably slightly thinner, um, a matter of maybe half a millimetre or something like that. No, no big difference. So it really is what you prefer. Um, and the sport version is also slightly cheaper. Um, I believe there's five five dollars difference in it. So I just show you I'm loading this up the same way. It works exactly the same as the classic does. And very, I think it's a really nice looking wallet, and it's it's well well designed. So everything's easy to get to, and everything's sort of simply simple to access, um, which is what you want in a wallet. And it keeps it already slim as well and good looking. And I think. Um, as I said, I, I wasn't expecting it to be this nice. I think the pictures probably don't do it justice, but it's an excellent wallet once I, I got my hands on it. I was really quite taken with it. Um, and I'll show you the dimensions here. So it, as I say, it is pretty small, um, as we can see here, and the all important uh, thickness, uh, very slim, just 10, well, nearly 11. So that is the um, the wallet by Loft of Canby. Um, a really nice, excellent, slim wallet, um, and one that I'm quite a big fan of. Don't forget to visit the Slim Wallet Junkie uh, blog for the latest wallet news and reviews. And also check out our shop for the best Slim Wallets.